Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're going to be, uh, we're obviously back playing BT, uh, BTD6 and we're going to be using the Ancient Monkey mod again. Today we're actually going to be playing on the Blondes map. So I added a mod just for the sake of, uh, I know I could have done this in the challenge editor, but at least with this, you know, maybe one day we'll be able to use, we'll play uh, Ultra Chimps on this map. But mainly because I wanted uh, to use my powers. Because I didn't, you know, I wanted my tech bot, okay? I wanted tech bots. And I figured, you know, let's, you know, it doesn't hurt. You know, let me just, let me just have my tech bots, okay? Let me have my tech bots in peace, okay? So, that's why I'm doing a mod for it instead of just a challenge editor. Yeah, that also means that we can do some other cool things with it. So we'll kind of see how that goes. Let's get rid of the birds. Yeah, I've never ever played on this map before. So this is my very first time playing on it. And we're using the Ancient Monkey. We'll see how this goes. And in case anyone's curious why I put him right there. It's because you can get things like Tax Zone, Ring of Fire, things like that. So I'm thinking everything else should be pretty much fine. I don't think anything really needs like really needs to be placed in a different spot. I think everything else should be fine. So uh, I'm just kind of doing I'm just putting him there to kind of optimize the ring of fire or if we get like attack zone or anything like that. So yeah, well, let's just kind of see how this goes and see how long he can last for. Hopefully. I assume he can beat the blondes map. I mean, like, that should be... That should be a given. Ultra Chimps on this map, though, I feel like is going to be impossible. Monkeynomics, right off the bat, you are just... You're... Thank you, game. Thank you. I... You know what? After I... After that Ultra Chimps video that took hours and hours to record, I highly appreciate you. For giving me monkey nomics right off the bat. That is so generous of you to do that. I have our ultra strike ability. Get another ability. Spike storm is going to be incredible on this map. I already know spike storm is going to be crazy. MIB. Get some more, uh, get some more weapons. Like, yeah, see, Tack. Tack would be good. Etienne. Okay, we'll go for Etienne. We already have MIB, so, I mean, camo, leads, they're no problem anymore for us. We just need to pop everything else that kind of, that comes our way. Oh, my gosh. Summon Phoenix. I'll take it. Oh my gosh, the game is being so kind to me today. Definitely want to save our Spike Storm for the Moab, though, whenever that comes out. Well, I say whenever it comes out, like I don't know what round it comes out on. Oh, let's go for a Zeely. Go for another Sada. Go for another Sada. Go for another Sada. <laughs> <laughs> We have like four or five sodas at this point. Um, only, only four or five, you know. I'm pretty sure the MIB counts for like the abilities as well. If I'm not, if I'm not wrong. Hot shot, double shot, Moab glue. Eventually, we definitely want to start upgrading our weapons. Not sure when I want to do that, but we'll see. We'll see how things go. I would love to get another uh, Monkey Nomics ability. That would be that would be great. Imagine Energizer with this guy, though, to make the abilities, like, show up faster. 
Ah, uh, teleportation, okay. That's not like a, that's not a bad ability. Yeah, it definitely seems like MIB works um, on the abilities as well, which is really nice. Snowstorm, okay. I guess I'll take it. Okay. Okay. That's kind of that's the that's the main thing I wanted to save that for. Was for Moabs. I am probably going to end up losing to Moabs again in the future because I'm just going like, to kind of like let my abilities do their thing and not really pay attention. But And I'm also being very greedy as well. Because I'm like not upgrading my weapons when I really should be. Get a monkey farmer. Why not? I'm not getting any elite sniper abilities. I'm surprised by that. Mob assassin. Listen, hear me out. <laughs> nah, wall of fire is probably going to be better, so. Let's finally get a stronger weapon upgrade, I guess. Go for that. Start investing a bit more into our... Into making our weapons stronger. That's a good one. That's for money, mainly. That's a good one. That'll generate more money for us. That'll generate more money for us. See, so, yeah, I mean, mainly, main, we're mainly going for like damage, but yeah, I mean, more money is obviously good too. That's kind of why I keep going for abilities. <laughs> Oh, another MIP. Eh, whatever. Oh, we got Churchill. Nice. At this point, I would rather just things that are going to give us money. But yeah, wow. This, um... I mean, yeah, I, I guess it, it really is just like the early... The early game is like... Like, you don't know what to do. Or like I feel like like the early game is definitely like the hardest bit and then everything after that is just kind of smooth sailing. It's like there's not really any any difficult part after the early game. There we go, ring of fire. Just, <laughs> just what I needed at this point in time when it's doing less damage than like our freaking dart that he shoots out. <laughs> go for an Adora attack. Uh, let's go for hot shot. Shoots out more projectiles. Maybe I should just let him be for now. Let's try to let's try to go for like round a hundred, and uh, we'll go from there. For destroyer, destroyer, I barely know her. Sorry, <laughs> that was a bad joke. Let's go for cluster. We 
And then let's just start upgrading our weapon, I guess. Or should I see how far we can get? Because we could probably get really far. Because the question isn't even like, can he beat the blonde map? The question is, how far can he reach on the blonde map? Like, I could probably just sit here, go to sleep, wake up, and we'd still be still be taking on the blondes map. I don't think... See, there's the elite sniper. I think now we want to go for money-making uh, abilities. Because eventually we obviously want to... Uh, Save up for this for the advanced ancient monkey upgrade. So then if we can get that. Um then we'll be in good spot. We just keep getting teleportation though. Which is honestly fine. Because the only thing that really matters is when we do upgrade him. Which we definitely want to hold off before we Decide to just upgrade them though. Because we can only re reset the prices once, you know? So, if you reset the prices, then. Then that's a one time thing, and you're just gonna have to kind of live with the consequences of it. My gosh, we just keep getting... Like, I, I want, like, Monkey Nomics or Elite Sniper. I want abilities that are going to generate us money, not deal damage. It's like, I, I appreciate the damage. I'm not, uh, you know, I'm not upset that I'm getting more damage, but... I just feel like it's kind of unnecessary. There we go, another Elite Sniper. That's what I need Okay, well, let's go into free play. That, <laughs> that Zom G did not even show up on the screen before he got demolished. Yeah, now we have two elite sniper abilities. That is $12,000 if we get, when we, you know, use both of them. So that's pretty good. Snowstorm. That one doesn't really matter. I don't really care about it. I wonder why it does count as like four elite sniper abilities. Because obviously the elite sniper just just calls in like one, right? Like, it just drops in one crate. So I wonder why it uses... Why it, why it gives it two. Rather than just one. I mean, I'm definitely not complaining. I'll take the extra $3,000 per ability. But... I'm just curious. Another Tech Terror, okay, great. Because we definitely need that.
Like yeah, our damage abilities don't even really do anything. That's the that's the problem though. It's like we get to a you get to a point where your ability or your your main monkey is so strong that your abilities are just kind of there. So So if when you do get abilities that deal damage, it's kind of like, well, what am I supposed to do with this? Because it doesn't really do anything. I feel like, oh, you know what? I think, I think my what might actually end up getting us though is, oh my gosh, I can't click on this thing. I think what might end up getting us is the speed of the balloons. I feel like with how quickly their speed ramps up, I feel like they're gonna like, especially the the DDTs. I feel like they're just gonna like speed on past. What did I just say? What did I just freaking say? Did I not just mention how that was gonna happen? That actually, never mind. I think that was just a lack of damage. Never mind. Forget what I was saying. Can I not hit? Is there something that can't hit leads? Or is that just like an ability? Like, I don't understand. What cannot hit leads? Because I'm hearing like the lead popping sound. Or like, like the sound that is made when a, when a, a tower cannot hit leads. So I'm trying to figure out what is not able to hit the lids. What's not able to hit the DDTs. Because we should have, we, we, I mean, we have MIB. There shouldn't really be anything that can't pop lids. We've had like four MIBs. I mean, if with four MIBs you can't pop any leads, I'm gonna be a little concerned. Unless maybe, yeah, like like I said, maybe it's like an ability or something that can't pop leads. I'm not sure, but that just seems really weird. Another spike storm, okay. I'll take it. I'm really just not getting any money making abilities. Okay, I'm very much so surprised by this. So I think I might just save up for the advanced ancient monkey upgrade. It really doesn't seem like I'm going to get any more abilities that are going to give me money. Obviously, other than the ones that I already have. Carpet spikes. Come on. Where are the money making abilities? This is ridiculous. Okay, elite sniper, there we go. Go for first strike, I guess. Uh, we'll go for blade maelstrom. Another monkey nomics, there we go. 
All we needed was to get the freaking advanced ancient monkey and we finally get the abilities that I'm, I've been looking for. And overclock. See, that's... Where, where has that been? Where has overclock been? Overclock would have been so good so much earlier. Yeah, that overclock is doing numbers at this point. Like, it is. That has really buffed up everything. Like, it, it's definitely made a difference. Another monkey nomics, I'll take it. Another spike storm. Don't really need another overclock, it's got full uptime. Another elite sniper ability, okay. Wonder what it'd be like to have, to give this guy ultra boost. Maybe that's something to try in the future. A super buffed ancient monkey. Let me know if you guys would want to see that. See now we're just kind of rolling in the dough. And I'm happy about it. Very happy. Okay, so laser blast would be good. Adora would be good. Hyper fire. Being a fire. Plasma accelerator, I guess. Laser. Mexicals. I want more money. Upgrades. Country expert. Something bullet. Adora. Cluster, reduction, permit charge, spirit of the forest, I guess. Didn't really want to get that, but it is a legendary, so. Perma brew? Can he perma brew himself? Wait, can he actually do that? Wait, can he? It doesn't look like he has that ability to perma brew himself, but that would be crazy if he could. Um, another recursive cluster, I guess. Century champion? Sure. Balloon, balloon crush? I'm really- Oh, okay. Let's try continuing again and see if- If using all of our abilities at once. Oh, okay. Of course. The moment we use all of our abilities at once, then then it gets shredded. Um, did I break it? Where's the next one? Oh, there it is. Jeez. Okay, sticky bomb. I feel like that plasma accelerator thing. Whatever, you know, we're, I'm, I'm gonna stop using continues. Even though really the continues, all it does is just use all the abilities. Um, it doesn't really do much in turn. What? Why was there only one weapon that I could choose? That was weird. But yeah, it doesn't really do anything for damage. It just kind of refreshes our abilities. But, yeah, anyways, uh, my name's Sam. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of, uh, you know, me testing out the Ancient Monkey on the Blondes map. Could have definitely got far, uh, further if I got more money-making abilities and weapons. That's fine. We did. I could have. I could also go for stronger weapons and 
decimate every single round from now on but i'm not gonna do that i'm not gonna prolong this video any further but yeah so if you guys enjoyed it please leave a like on and subscribe to the channel it'd mean the world to me it doesn't cost you guys anything and yeah i hope to see you guys in the next one you guys take care